No, wait, Roger, if you didn't see any of the actors, how, were you on set? Like, how did they not see you? How did you voice? Uh, I was off to the side. Excuse me. And, uh, well, the first night I was actually outside the window under a small canopy. A very small canopy. <laughs> and uh, it was raining. So I was standing out there in the rain, looking at her through the window like this. <laughs> I'm all right. From then on, I was always off in a room somewhere nearby with the cell phone hooked up to their cell phone, connected. And I'm watching the camera feed so I could see them and they couldn't see me. I'm feeling a little creepy right now. <laughs> Did you guys know he was on set in a little room watching you? Like that's, I didn't know where he was. I knew he was somewhere, obviously. Yeah. Um, but no, I, I wasn't, I was never aware of where he was in the room. Roger, did you ever have the urge to talk to them in your Mojo Jojo voice from Powerpuff Girls? There was no Mojo at that time. <laughs> the chemical X has not been spilled as yet. But that would have been interesting. It's well, more of a game, really. Can you handle that money? <laughs> this doesn't work, is it? No, but whenever you go to a recording session or something, people go, would, would you do my answering machine? So I shouldn't ask you that? <laughs> okay, so Steve, can you give us your best Ghostface Killer impression, as if you were the one talking on the phone? Since technically it was supposed to be you. <laughs> just say no. It's been a long time, I gotta really just say no. Um, what was the line on? What's the matter, Sydney? You look like you've seen a ghost. Ooh, very good. I think, I think next, since you never got to be the killer on the phone, you should do it now, too. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'll pass on that one.